Hey guys, it's Vaughan from the Joey Crew. Welcome back to the fifth instalment of the University Boxing. We're now just two weeks away from the fight, which means these fighters should be getting close to their fighting form. Now, as we know, these fighters have been training really hard, which means that the training doesn't get easier, but hopefully they're punching harder. Let's have a look. I mean, wow. As you can see, these fighters have really transformed. It really looks like they... Oh, these aren't the fighters. Oh, oh, the fighters are over here, sorry. <laughs> oh, look at this. We spotted a wild Donny the Johnny. How are you getting on? Yeah, not too bad, mate, not too bad. Basically, today, we're going to do straight sparring. So we're going to basically get them in the ring, see if the ideas we have are correct. And if they are, then we'll leave happy. If not, we've got a long night ahead of us thinking about what to do. Right, let's have a look. Really important day today, guys. These fighters are, are, are finding out where their work's genuinely going to pay off. Um, some people are going to be let down. It could be quite emotional. Some people are going to realise what kind of fight they've got in store for themselves. There's really a different tone here today in the gym. You can feel the tension, the seriousness. These guys want it. That was pretty intense. These fighters have got a lot to prove, and they've got a lot to lose. Gonna head downstairs, and we're moving on to fitness now. Let's Come, go, on. Luke. Come on, let's go. Well, I've got some bad news, guys. You know we were manifesting it, but Jib potentially, well, he doesn't have a, a fighter. Cameron's dislocated his shoulder. It's it's too bad, and there's no there's no there's no equivalent match for Jim. So neither of them are going to be fighting on fight night. Manifestation destroyed. Okay, so we're just that much closer from finding out who these fighters are going to be matched up with. Some of them are going to be disappointed because they're going to be disappointed with their matchup. Some of them are going to be disappointed because they're not going to be able to fight. What we do know is that we've got the most, some of the most exciting matchups in the event's history. But unfortunately, Jim and Cameron are out. We've basically got the matches sorted now. So we're going to have a chat with Chris, we're going to have a chat with Sam, and uh, basically just confirm what we already know and that's that we've got a, a brilliant show coming up i think at the moment i couldn't actually say definitively on any of them who's going to win so we've got a fight on our hands obviously um looking at it tonight few which are quite obviously got to happen few which can't happen and a few which you know we 
don't really know which way to make up. First and foremost, um, safety is, is the key. Yeah, we'd like you all to fight, but we've got to make sure that the matches are right. It's not a case of dragging it out for the sake of the drama and the suspense. It's purely to make sure that we got these matches right. So how do we feel about this matchups? A lot of these fighters are, are waiting in anticipation. Is there anything you can say at this point? I'm gutted, to be honest. I wish everyone could fight. Um, it's one of those where it was so much easier when we were scrubbing around the night before looking for anyone to fight a lad. But they've all trained so hard and to, to, to put that message in later and say to some people, look, we just can't have you, that's going to be that's going to be gutting. It's going to be hard to let him down, I'm sure. Yeah, and uh, me versus Vaughan is going to be the uh, the centre stage. So. I mean, I, th I think we know how that's going to end. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's getting intense. The fight night's coming up. Last few weeks of prep is, you can tell people are seriously starting to switch on, get their A game. Yeah. Starting to actually turn up to training and put some decent shots in on me as well, which I love, to be honest. I love getting hit hard. Have you got a, uh, a fight name sorted out yet? No, I haven't, you know. I still need to think of a name and a, and a walkout too. I haven't thought of one yet. There's a couple on my mind, but I want to make sure I get the right one. Yeah, yeah. It's probably a good thing. He's been too invested in the training. <laughs> Gotta be. Yeah. Well, good luck, mate, anyway. Cheers, boss. Thank you very much. OK, we're going to leave it there, guys. All of these fighters are going to have a restless few nights waiting in anticipation, finding out whether they're going to fight or not and who they're going to fight. But we're going to come back right now.